What is geophysical logging? Geophysical logging is a technique used in geology and engineering to measure physical properties of rocks and soils by means of instruments that are lowered into boreholes or wells. The data collected from these instruments can provide valuable information about subsurface geology, including the structure, composition, and properties of rocks and soils. There are many different types of geophysical logs that can be used to measure various physical properties. Some of the most common types of geophysical logs include Electrical resistivity logs, which measure the electrical resistance of subsurface materials. This can provide information about the porosity, permeability, and water content of rocks and soils. Sonic logs, which measure the speed of sound waves traveling through subsurface materials. This can provide information about the density and elasticity of rocks and soils. Gamma ray logs, which measure the natural radiation emitted by subsurface materials. This can provide information about the lithology and stratigraphy of rocks and soils. Magnetic susceptibility logs, which measure the ability of subsurface materials to become magnetized. This can provide information about the mineralogy and magnetic properties of rocks and soils. Geophysical logs are typically recorded and stored digitally in real time, allowing for quick and efficient analysis of the data. The data can be used to create detailed profiles of subsurface geology, including cross sections and 3D models. Geophysical logging is widely used in a variety of applications including mineral exploration, oil and gas exploration, environmental site assessments, and groundwater studies. It can be particularly useful in situations where surface-based geophysical methods are limited, such as in areas with rugged terrain or thick vegetation cover. By providing detailed information about subsurface geology, geophysical logging can help reduce uncertainty and improve decision-making in a range of fields. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications.